Let's talk about rumors. It is finally that time of the year that we start looking for information and finding some pretty dubious information concerning the next Precure season. Yes, in 2021, we are going to have Tropical Rouge and there are some names circulating the internet already. Hello everyone, it's Leo, and in this video we are going to talk about the first batch of rumors from Tropical Rouge Precure that were found in Japanese web boards, Japanese forums. People are talking about them. But before we start actually talking about the Tropical Rouge rumors, let's remember what happened last year with Healing Good Precure. Healing Good obviously also had lots of rumors and one of the things that surfaced at the time was that we were going to have a duo consisting of Cure Perfume and Cure Clear. Both of them were going to be the main cures from Healing Good and well, we actually know that rumor was not true at all. Someone made that up trying to mess with our heads. But there was also another rumor at the time saying we were going to have three cures, pink, blue, and yellow, and their names were going to be Cure Grace, Cure Fontaine, and Cure Sparkle. Well, I think we know that at least last year, one of the rumors was correct. Yes, that rumor ended up being right. That is why this rumor that we're going to talk about today might be the real thing, or maybe not. Well, I think that one of the things that uh, speaks like, that doesn't speak like volumes about this rumor is that we don't have the colors of the cures in the rumor. So I, I don't know. I think those names are so nice that I don't believe they're true at all. So let's start talking about those names. Well, uh, this rumor states that we're going to have four cures for Tropical Rouge, which is a number I would like to see. And one of the cures is going to be called Cure Summer. I think that this is a name that has a lot to do with Tropical Rouge. Uh, it has a lot to do with the feel of the logo, with the feel of the website, and everything uh, concerning... Uh, what we know from Tropical Rouge already. So I feel like Cure Summer is a name that could work, but that would take out the possibility of them doing a season in the future talking about uh, the four seasons. You know, summer, autumn, uh, winter, and what is the name of the other season? I. Don't mind my head. Don't mind my head. You guys know how I forget things. So yeah, spring. <laughs> Sorry about that. So it would undermine the possibility of us having a season with uh, the this theme in the future. So I don't know. But I love Cure Summer as a name. That is very nice. So let's jump on to the next cure, which is going to be called Cure Papaya. And let me just say one thing here. I find this name so cheesy. <laughs> But this is my absolute favorite name from this rumor. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Just imagine if we had a cure called Cure Papaya. And just remember that lots of fans have been asking for an orange cure. Why not call her Cure Papaya? And I don't know, I, I don't really understand much about fruits, but I feel like uh, papayas and Fruits like that, uh, they they exude this tropical feeling. You know, uh, I would l also love to see Cure Banana or Cure Coconut as well. But Cure Papaya is the one that's in this rumor. So that's the one I'm mentioning. And as I said, from this rumor, Cure Papaya is my favorite name. If we actually had Cure Papaya, I would freak out. But this other name is also one of my favorites. I absolutely adore it, which is Cure Flamingo. I believe, again, I believe this might not be the real thing because uh, as we were stating the names, probably Cure Summer would be the main one. And Flamingo would work very well for a pink cure since, well, flamingos are pink. And maybe it would also work well for a red cure. I'm not really sure about that. Uh, so uh, Flamingo 
is a word that I love. It's also a bird that I love. It's so gay. I absolutely love it. And it also reminds me a little bit of Doflamingo from One Piece. He has a beautiful pink uh, coat. I don't even know what that is. It, it looks so fluffy and everything. I just know he's a villain from One Piece. I haven't gotten to his uh, part of the story yet. Um, I'll get there one day. Uh, so I would love to see Cure Flamingo, but would they do a Cure Flamingo that isn't the main cure, like that isn't pink? Maybe, as I said, they could work with a red cure, possibly? But I don't know. I just know I love this name. Just imagine how graceful she would be if we actually had an a real <laughs> Cure Flamingo. And last but not least, we also have Cure Coral. Cure Coral is uh, the last one out of this, this rumor that we've been mentioning. And I put uh, our dear Cure Marmaid here, my favorite from Go Princess, one of my favorite blue cures ever. I really, really love Cure Marmaid because she has an attack that uh, is called Cure Maelstrom. It, it's her last individual attack. And it creates like some corals and everything. And I believe that from all of the names that, that have been mentioned in this rumor, this one is the most believable one. I could really see, actually see a cure being called Cure Coral. Even if this rumor doesn't end up being the right thing. I believe the Cure Coral is a big possibility in actually being in a season like Tropical Rouge because it has a lot to do with the sea. It is a beautiful name and I feel like it would attract people just because of the name of the Cure. People would love the name Cure Coral. So I think that this is a name that it's, it's beautiful, it works, it has this rhythm in it. And as I said, I feel like from all of the names that were mentioned, this one is definitely the most believable one. And even if this rumor proves to not be true, which can happen, which I think it's the most likely possibility, I still think that Cure Coral is a possibility for Tropical Rouge nonetheless. So this rumor basically states that there is not going to be a Cure Samba. And this rumor doesn't finish here. It also says that there is going to be a fairy that looks similar to Goma-chan. And uh, this is the anime that has this mascot called Goma-chan. This white mascot right here is Goma-chan. And, well, uh, this is a sea creature. It, it kind of like, it, it looks like a seal, right? Uh, it... Seals aren't tropical animals, so I don't know if it actually works or not. But since we're talking about a magical show, we're talking about magical possibilities. So why not have a seal? Maybe uh, the seal was uh, some uh, was a magical creature from a land that was more like a polar uh, land, and then it was attacked and it had to come to a tropical land. We don't know, but uh, I, I I like this because seals are very cute animals. And I would like, this is something that we haven't thought of. We could have like lots of different sea animals that aren't exactly tropical being uh, the mascots for Tropical Rouge. So why not have a seal like mascot, even if it doesn't fit the tropical theme, doesn't exactly fit the tropical theme. I don't know. I just know it could work. I just know that I would love to see a seal or a sea lion creature as a mascot. Just imagine a sea lion creature as like the wise mascot or like the older mascot, kind of like Puruns was or Choro Sama in Kira Kira Precure. I don't know. I just feel like it would be nice if we had a mascot like this. Anyways, this was basically the rumor that we have for Tropical Rouge right now. As I said, take this with a grain of salt or the most grains of salts you can because this is basically a rumor and as I said last year we had rumors one was right one was wrong this can be right as well I find the names very cheesy but I like all of them very much especially cure papaya just imagine if we actually had a cure papaya but take this with a grain of salt because this might not really be the real thing unfortunately if we had the names those names in tropical rouge i would 
love it so much. Anyways, this is all for now. I want to take this little time to thank all of the members of the Magical Cinnamon channel. If you are a member, thank you so much for all of your support. Thank you so much for standing by me and for believing in Magical Cinnamon. And if you've watched everything up until now, thank you so much as well. Remember, we might have leaks of Tropical Rouge, but if we don't have leaks, we're going to learn more about this season by the end of the month, most specifically around Christmas time. So hold on to your horses. It's almost time. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, bye-bye.